Welcome back, everybody, once more here to some more Mogscast. We are playing uh, Project Zomboid again here today. And uh, if you watched the last episode, you know we left off, uh, we tried to hit the garages and storage sheds down to the south, down the road a little ways, without much luck in the way of hardware, in the uh, hammers, nails, uh, axes, sledgehammers, nothing like that we were able to find. So unfortunately, uh, we're going to be pushing, uh, well, I guess, not unfortunately, next up, we're going to be pushing into town here a little bit more. Uh, and going kind of down Main Street, so this could be this could be interesting. We're gonna take it nice and slow and uh, try to get out of this rain, actually. So let's hurry this one up. I know there's probably gonna be a few zombies around here, but for the most part, I'm just gonna head inside here just real quick. Maybe let the uh, oh, stuff starting to go bad. Sure is. Yikes. That's unfortunate. Well, why don't we take the few things that uh, aren't bad in here just yet? Maybe we'll get lucky with a few other things. Some fresh carrots and banana. Rotten lettuce, fresh orange, a banana. Is that rotten grapes? No, they're still doing okay. It's rotten watermelon. Uh, this looks all good. Okay, maybe we'll spend a little bit of time here clearing up as much of this as we can before it all goes bad. But we are going to be heading into town. Might as well uh, grab a drink while we're here since dude's thirsty. Thankfully, he's dried off a little bit now. Drink! We still have a good amount of rounds. If we need them, we can swap to our gun pretty easily. Thankfully, the hotkey 2, if it's in your main inventory, and hotkey 1 will swap you back to your melee. I don't know if it's the first one in your list or if it's the last one active. I should probably look into that sometime. It'd be good to know, just in case. You never know when you might need it. The Gigamart, that's what that place is called, okay. We're gonna see if we can slip down over here, maybe kinda trek our way through the, uh, through this place. Oh, looks like we had a few zombies shift in there, let's pop this open if we can. Come on. Take a look, oh, they just saw me, that's fine. Close that behind us. And why don't we take all of this while we can? Yep, you guys go ahead and pound on the windows, that's fine. What's up, dudes? Anything? There was a doll. Nothing really great there. Let's close that behind us. Oops, there we go. Oh, hello. And that one seems to be partially in the door there. Let's go ahead. We're going to go upstairs, I think. No, we're going to We're going to head down here. Oh, this is a nice little little thing here. Ooh, nice. Another saw, we don't need it, but we will take nearly everything else. Leave the golf club and everything. Paper clips, I don't know if they're really used for anything just yet. Uh, you know what? I think I am going to grab the crowbar. Maybe I'm not. What do we have in here? Okay, we're overweight currently, so we need to eat. Why don't we go ahead and put an apple here, grab out a few bananas. We're going to munch these down real fast, so that in case they've broken through into the main hall here, we can take take them out. Eat another banana or two just to get up to a, a better f a fed level here. Fed, well fed, not bad. I'll take well, I'll take well fed. Okay, I don't see any zombies in here just yet. They're definitely going to be trying though soon, so why don't we head on out the front? We're going to try and see what we can do here for some damage on these guys. That's one down already. That's not too bad. Just going to try and keep an eye on our backside there. Nice, right, get another one down there. Blunt skill is actually not half bad these days. Okay, we're going to watch behind us a little bit. Take it nice and easy here. Give us our ourselves a second. Might be able to finish a few of these ones off. Oh, get out of there. Two more, one more down. Or one more to go, I should say, not down. Is that all of them? Nice, looks like we cleared up what we needed to. Big hiking bag, let's snag that. Uh, and just do a quick scan of these other ones real fast. 
if we can find them on the list here. Earrings, yeah, not not so super useful. Butter knife pistol, don't really need the, a couple of pistols. These guys were loaded. Okay. So we've checked them out. Let's Seahorse Cafe. Looks we got a few more that might be coming at us here. That's fine. Take a look around town. What's up, zombie? Come here, little buddy. We're gonna try and get inside this building here if we can get in. I think there's a hardware store around here somewhere. Get out of here. Come here, would ya? Is there a light on in here we could we could get? Ah, that's better. Looks like a bunch this might be a post office, okay. Are these containers? They sure aren't. Looks like somebody may be trying to get in here. Cigarettes, books, pens, shotgun shells. And we are overweight again. Let's go ahead and eat another banana. More shotgun shells. I suppose we can take them. Bring them back home. We're just going to try and clear these guys up. I don't want them to break down this door if we can help it. Ah. Alright, give ourselves a moment to catch up on our rest here. Let a few more of these guys filter in, but we should be able to handle these no problem. Yeah, take them both down. One, and is that both of them? I think I got them both right there. One more coming in here. Two more coming in. Oh, God. Come here, little buddy. Okay, checking loots real fast. But we're going to close this door. Ah, more zombies out here, are there? Okay, come here. Come here. Okay, let's check up these courses or corpses. We got another duffel there with painkillers. I'm actually going to take those painkillers. Uh, okay. How about this? I got an idea. We're going to go ahead and eat up the rest of these bananas, give him a rest for a sec. We're going to uh, equip the baseball bat in one hand, our primary only and bust out a second bag. Big hype can drop bag. Let's pull that in the main inventory. Unequip. And equip in primary. Equip secondary. That puts us below weight. We do have a couple heavy things in here though. Um, okay, we're actually going to go ahead and I think just check these real fast, see if there's anything in here that we can use, or is this all going to be books? Is this literally all going to be books? This is pretty much, I guess it's a post office, the back of a post office, I guess that sort of makes sense. Let's check these two boxes, still books. We can take a drink. You can just turn on a faucet? Oh, that's the light, okay, never mind. Oh, somebody broke in. Hey there. Ah, I think I got a few outside here. Okay. We can finish these guys off, I think. Wow, that was a good hit. Give him a moment to rest. We are over overload here, I think. 
17. Let's put... I guess I should keep looking around me. See how that guy's coming up behind me. We're going to put our pistol away. I think it's the rounds that were really, really wearing us down. That's okay, though. I'm going to check this building. Oh, no. Helicopter right now, really? That's not what I needed. Okay, well, they're getting pulled that way. I saw the one walking. Let's take a look here. Oh, God. Okay, we're good. I think we're good. That actually could be the uh, the warehouse that I'm kind of after. I guess we'll see. I'm hoping to find maybe a window here. Looks like a diner. So it could be a could be a place on there. What's up? What's up, zombies? Oh god, it's coming back this way. Okay. Well, we're gonna start moving. We're gonna start heading back, I think, because it is getting later in the day. Dude is getting tired. He's he's getting a tad sleepy. Oh, that's loud. And he has a strong panic. Tad weepy with a bit of panic. That's fine. Let's get in a little closer to home here. Leave behind these zombies. I gotta. I should do some investigating. What people recommend as far as finding. Uh, construction materials here in West Point because this is this seems like few and far between I either I'm just getting super unlucky with the spots they can or should be or there's better places to find it It'd be great to find out where because then we can get to building and which is what I'd really like to do and I've never really gotten a chance to do I'd, I'd like to get further into this game I just I always seem to die after a couple of days or a week or so on, on my characters I've never made it very much further past that and I want to get in that gun shop just to the north of us here at Twiggy's. In fact, why don't we go take a look at that and just show you what I'm talking about because it's right up here. Just right over here. What did I just lose? I had a tad weepy and drowsy, but then I had something in between. I'll have to take a look later. Guns and ammo shop here is what I'm talking about. A couple of soda pops. Come on, zombies. You guys want to play? You want to play some games? Wanna play baseball? Get out of there. Okay. Give him a rest, let him catch his breath real fast. And then we also have skill points to spend. I totally forgot about that. So we got ourselves some points we can spend, or at least a point. Stay down. Got them both there, I do believe. Sure did. Let's check these other two. No dice. Okay, what do we got to spend as far as points go? We got two points. We can put it in light-footed sneaking. I'm going to put a point in blunt since we have been using blunt a lot. And uh, light-footed. Light-footed is what exactly? I wish these gave a little bit of a tooltip. Um, can I see it in this? Not so much. Okay. Uh, cooking's getting there. I could do... I need to get one in sprinting. That's what I really like. I think light footed just makes you make less noise. Just overall. Whereas sneaking just makes you a bit more efficient when you're actually holding down control and sneaking around. Or I guess right mouse as well? Yeah, right mouse click as well if you hold that down. Uh, I am gonna go ahead and put one into sneaking. So that our sneaking's a little better when we need it most. At least that's my current thought process on it. It might be the dumb decision, comparatively, based on how things are balanced, but uh, I don't know, so I'm going with my gut on this one. Let's toss our food in here so that we can prevent it from all going bad. Ice cream? I didn't even notice I had ice cream. Peaches, peas, pickles, radish, salmon. Strawberries, tomatoes, all going in. There we go. Just letting that transfer over. Well, I guess our next goal in the next episode, because we're probably going to go ahead and call it here. Our guy's getting a little sleepy. Uh, very sleepy. And he could use some water. 
So as soon as we can get all this stuff transferred out and into the fridge here, we will be going ahead to call this episode uh, for this for this time. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and hit that like button. If you like the series, I would greatly appreciate it. I'm, I'm, I've been enjoying playing it again. It's been a little while. But uh, until next time, guys, uh, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you next time. Cheers!